Welcome! In front of me I have Garmin 4 runner 165 and I'm gonna show you how to enable the phone notifications for this watch on the iPhone. Basically if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch. Before we start, if you want to receive the notifications on your watch, your watch needs to be paired with your iPhone via the Garmin Connect application. And once the devices are paired together, we can continue. And now we need to make sure that the required permissions are allowed for the Garmin Connect application and your iPhone to send the notifications to your watch. So let's open the settings on our iPhone. In settings, find the Bluetooth option and tap on it. And here you should see a list of my devices and on it you should see your Forerunner 165. Tap on the info icon next to it. And here you should see the option called share system notifications. And this, this option needs to be enabled. So make sure it is enabled. If you don't see this option uh, in this menu, close the settings. Open the Garmin Connect. In the Garmin Connect application, uh, tap on more, Garmin devices, select your 4 runner 165, tap on uh, notifications and alerts, tap on smart notifications, and here tap on, for example, during activity and turn off the notifications and then turn them back on. And then go back to the uh, device page and wait. Uh, wait until the pop-ups come, come out about the permissions for the notifications and, and when you see the pop-ups, tap on allow. And once you allow the permissions, you can go back to settings, uh, Bluetooth, tap on info, and you should see this option right here and make sure it is enabled. Then go back to the main page of settings, find the option called the, or rather find the connect application on the list right here, tap on it and make sure that the Bluetooth option is enabled. And once it is, we can go back to the uh, Garmin Connect application. So let's open the Garmin Connect. Tap on more. Uh, scroll down, tap on Garmin devices. Select our Forerunner runner 165. Tap on notifications and alerts. Tap on smart notifications. And here we have during activity, general use and signature. If you tap on during activity, you can customize the notifications during activity. Basically, when you're tracking activity on your watch, like running, cycling and stuff like that. And here we can turn on and off the notifications by tapping on the switch. We can tap on specific types of notifications like calls, texts and apps and customize them. We can turn them on and off. We can enable or disable the tone or vibration for any of them. So customize them to your liking. And once you're done, you can go back, tap on general use. And here we can again turn on and off the notification for the notifications for general use. Uh, and general use means basically whenever you're not tracking any activity. So if you're not uh, performing any sports or other tracking activity or recording any activity on your watch, uh, that's the general use state. And you can enable and disable the notifications for it. You can customize the types of notifications so we can turn off or on the notifications, the sound or vibration. So you can customize it to your liking. And once you're done, you can also tap on privacy and here you can select press start or gesture. And what this option does is basically if you select, for example, press start and you receive the notifications on your watch, they won't display the content notifica not of notifications until you press the start button or perform the gesture. And the timeout basically means uh, how long the notification will stay on the screen after you receive it. And you can select short, medium or long. And once you're done with the settings of the notifications, go back to the device page of your watch and sync the devices together to apply the settings. And at this point, we should be able to receive the notifications on our watch. So I'm going to send myself a message. As you can see, we got it on our iPhone and also on our watch. If you miss, miss the notification on your watch, you can always press the up or down button on the uh, current watch face, the home page to scroll through the list of glances and one of the glances should be called notifications. As you can see, we have the one notification. We can press start to enter and here we have it. Okay. And once you're done, or rather, we are done. So that's how you um, enable the phone notifications for this smartwatch on the iPhone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video 
helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video. Thank you.